What's good, everybody? This your boy JTL, opposite from the norm. Damn, looking at my head, boy, I need to give me a cut. <laughs> but uh, what's good? Before I start this off, I want to say Happy Mother's Day to you know all the mothers out there. Whether you with somebody or not, don't matter. What matters is you there for your kids, doing everything that you can possibly work hard to do, showing them love, encouragement, educating them, raising them right. You know, doing the best that you can. So, like Tupac said, you are appreciated. Shout out to my mom. Shout out to my sister. You know, God bless you. I love y'all. So, this show is going to be about, real quick, Steve Harvey. Apparently, his show got canceled. Uh, a lot of people are speculating that it could be because he said what he said to poor people. Talking about how, you know, rich people early in the morning, they out there doing the stock market. They barely get eight hours of sleep. They out there making decisions about your life while your ass in the bed sleep. <laughs> so I know a lot of people out there might be like, man, yeah, good. Fuck Steve Harvey. Then plus the rumors that he might be getting divorced and they did a little clip on his show, him and his wife making fun of everybody. And I think they had their son on there. Um, really, I want to say, man, you know what? What's crazy? I don't know if you can call it karma or what. Maybe this show just was up. But they saying that the show still was getting great ratings. So to abruptly for it to get canceled, they thinking it came from that. But I'm like, man, he done said a lot of shit that probably could have got his show canceled. But they saying that it may be because of the poor people statement. So they uh, recorded the last show Thursday, which was, I think, the ninth, if I'm not mistaken. And that they're going to show... Um, his his last finale his episode that he last recorded in in june so i don't know i want to get y'all opinion you know what i mean i don't know if it came actually from you know his comment what he said and they were saying that you know he was crying you know when he was recording the last show his wife showed him some love and i'm gonna be honest with you i stopped kind of messing with him after he did what he did to monique on the show i felt like you didn't really have a back so if that's what is the cause of it, then let's keep it real. This is what he got to understand. Why he telling Monique, oh, this is the money game. This ain't the black and white. Or oh, it is black and white. You black. You can't be out here saying this and saying that. Then you say something about poor people. They get offended and then your show get canceled the following week. What does that tell you? That's why I re respected a brother like Nipsey Hussle, God rest his soul, because he was about being his own businessman, having his own ownership. You can't get into this corporate world and think you're going to be a boss to the point where nobody can touch you, nothing. That's why he tries to make sure to tell people like Monique to watch what you say and watch what you do. But guess what? You got comfortable, bro. You still got comfortable. Like I said, I don't know if it came from his statement and people outraged, but check this out. You still got comfortable. You had one of the highest rated talk shows and you mean to tell me you still got canceled. This man had almost 2 million viewers a week. Each, ep each, each episode. So you mean to tell me you still got canceled? And we don't know why? Of course, he's going to probably get on the radio and be like, you know, it happens. And I'm definitely going to report on that. You know, I just wanted to report on what I just heard. And most of the time, I like to wait until there's more info that came out that I can report on. But y'all leave y'all comments, man. What you think? Do you think that... He got canceled because of what he said or something else deeper than that. You know what I mean? So like, share, make sure if you never did it yet, subscribe. And once again, happy Mother's Day to all the real mothers out there that's out there on the day-to-day -day out there for their kids. Love.